A large coalition of male lions has left a huge footprint on the Maasai Mara in Kenya. A coalition of six big male lions called the Notch Coalition. They have ruled over an area of about 1,000 square kilometers for about a decade of their dominance. From the year 2008 to mid of 2017, the Notch Boys were the most popular coalition of male lions in Africa. They ruled over many prides of lions as they moved around over the years. Notch was an iconic black-maned male lion who appeared in the Maasai Mara in the year 2003 along with his coalition partner. A year later they had finally taken over the famous Marsh Pride of Lions. But Notch found himself being a single pride male in mid-2005, after his coalition partner was killed by intruding males. Several cubs had been born into the Marsh Pride sired by Notch and his partner in 2005. Five males and three females to be exact. Against all odds, Notch held on to his territory for another two years. But in 2007, three new males muscled in and finally chased him off. Usually that marks the end of a male lion, as single nomads mostly don't survive long but Notch did something very unusual. He did not leave his territory alone but took his five sons with him. These five young males were named. Notch II, Mighty Long, Ron, Caesar, and Grimace. They were expelled from their Marsh Pride lands in 2007, when the sons were around two and a half years old. For a year or so, Notch took care of not only himself but also his sons. A year later in 2008, Notch and his sons returned and took the Marsh Pride back. But that wasn't enough for them. They conquered Pride after Pride and at one point, they had seven Prides in total. There was nobody to challenge such a dominant force. They were the undisputed kings. From 2008 to 2010, they seemed invincible. But in 2010, the coalition lost the first member. Mighty Long was the first to go and vanished in the Mara Triangle. The remaining five were still a formidable force and were still the dominant males. Four brothers under their father's guidance continued their impressive reign until 2013 when Notch himself never returned from a mission in enemy territory. Only a few months after Notch's disappearance, Grimace got lost during one of his excursions to find new females in enemy territory. The remaining three Notches finally settled down in the Lookout Hill area, still being a formidable coalition of three big male lions. The final chapter of the Notch's reign started mid-2016 when Ron went missing and never showed up again. He was killed by other dominant males known as Sand River Males. A year later, Caesar developed a limp and lost condition. The reason turned out to be an abscess in his upper right hind leg. Vets treated him but two months later, he was found being in a very bad state again and hardly being able to move. He was last seen lying motionless on the banks of the Mara River close to Lookout Hill. It was not a fight with other lions, it was not a conflict with humans, Caesar died naturally. With the demise of Caesar, there was only one of the notches left, it was Notch too. At an age of almost 13 years and being all by himself, his days seemed numbered as younger males were rising nearby. Notch too quickly vacated his last territory without a serious fight. He was seen wandering around what used to be the stomping grounds just a few years ago. Notch 2 disappeared and everyone speculated that he was dead. But it wasn't the end. The legendary son of Notch resurfaced once again and took a page out of his father's book. He took his son Spearboy under his wing and as of November 2019, lives with him. He's 15 years old and somehow still holding on. It's safe to say that the Notch Coalition is one of the most successful lion coalitions of all times. The legacy of the Notches will live on as they have sired countless cubs with many of them are now adults. They are now ruling over vast areas of the Maasai Mara and beyond. The story of the Notches is an amazing story of truly wild lions, strong bonds, cleverness, braveness and pure power.